And I think I've spent close to $80 on pregnancy tests in the last two days. God. Hey guys, um, okay, so I'm editing this and I guess, I don't know why, but I just kind of felt the need to preface the next parts of this video with a disclaimer that this was all very real and although it's not picture perfect and it's not exactly what I had envisioned or thought would happen, this was real life. And I feel like this may be relatable for some women. So I'm just going to put together the footage that I do have, um, for the most part, in its entirety. And hope that you guys like it or can relate or whatever. So be it. This is not any kind of like Hollywood production type footage. It is real life. Okay, the house is a mess. I look like a crazy person, but I figured that I would record this because I think I might be pregnant. Yeah. Okay, so I don't even know if you can see, but those look like lines to me, guys. Both of them. So I'm taking a digital. That one didn't show anything. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. But I definitely see lines right there. Do you guys see it on the left? Those little, those lines? Oh my God. I'm only like, I don't know, 10? today, but this is around the time I found the Jameson, so I don't know. I don't even want to look. Got him in the back. Can I go walk? You want to run? I'm going to bath water because there's enough in there, okay? Hi, John. Okay. This one's just not pregnant. <laughs> Damn it. But I see lines there. Do you guys see that on the left right here? Maybe I'll go get a first response. I don't know, man. Okay, it's been a little while and it looks like there is a second line on this one right here. So, Jameson and I are gonna get ready. I don't really see it on this one right here too. Um, Jameson and I are gonna get ready and go pick up some first response. Okay, um, home with the tests and breakfast because I'm being lazy this morning. First response. Some Equate blue dye test, which I'm not a fan of blue dye tests, but whatever, we'll try it. And the clear blue digital, but I'm gonna wait until tomorrow to take this one. Oh, I'm nervous. <laughs> Here it goes. I don't know if you can see it. In person, I can see it. This one for sure. But I've already taken these. You guys, I'm shaking. I haven't even really processed this yet. I literally just like, okay, I couldn't wait because I'm antsy as hell. And I really wanted to get a digital test before I told Amy. I literally peed in one of the sterile cups that we used to use when we were doing early inseminations with Jameson. Um, and I took this test in the car, in the parking lot behind Walmart neighborhood market. And it's positive. Sorry, I stopped recording because I'm like, oh my God. I can't believe this is real. I can't believe this is real. I can't believe this is real. I keep accidentally stopped recording because I don't know what to do with myself. Oh my God, okay. Like I woke up so nauseous this morning, but I was hungry. Like I never wake up hungry right off the bat. 
and I've just, my, my left breast has been producing milk all of a sudden. And I just was so nauseous and my boobs have been burning. Like, I can't believe it. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. I have to tell Amy, Amy's at work. She never works weekends and she's working today. I need to figure out a way that I'm going to surprise her. Oh my God, you guys. Here it is, the car test. Oh my God. Okay guys, um, Jameson's in the background watching Shrek. But I've taken some more tests, and despite what happened a few months ago, I am 99.999% certain that I'm pregnant. And it's weird this time around because I'm having more time to kind of like soak it in, and I still haven't shared it with Amy, mostly because I don't want her to go through what we went through back in February. So I've taken many more tests. I'm still getting a negative on the clear blue digital. I've only gotten a positive on that one digital so far, but then I read into it, I Google things, um, so I'm gonna try to pick up a different kind of digital. If I get a yes on that one, I think we're gonna tell her today. Right, bud? Are we gonna tell mama today? Do you want a baby brother or sister? No, oh, this is favorite pastime. Anyway, this is the first response that I took today. You can definitely see that second one. Yesterday's looks like nothing now compared to this one. And then I took another one foe and one of these other cheapy ones that wasn't showing yesterday, but now it is a little bit. So I think, I think we did it guys. I'm so excited and I'm freshly out of bed. So again, don't judge me. I'm always looking a hot mess. And my tan line, check that out. I will keep you posted. We're probably gonna go to Target in an hour-ish when they open. It's only a little after. It's like almost 6.30 right now, I think. We're up pretty early, but not as early as yesterday. So yeah, keep you guys in the loop. I'm really excited to be able to surprise Amy. I don't think she has any idea. I think she thinks I'm like PMSing and I'm getting ready to start my period. I've kind of played it off really well, so. So excited. Okay, I have acquired the APT test after many attempts at different stores. And now I'm gonna pee and we're gonna, fingers crossed that this is it. Okay, so that test came up negative, which I had a feeling it would. Let me get it, I'll show you. Came up um, not pregnant, which I don't even know if you could see it. I had a feeling that it would, but I was hopeful that it would come up positive, <sighs> which I'm just bummed about because I was really hoping to surprise Amy today, but I will have to wait an extra day because I really just want to get that see the word you know that is what i really want so this is definitely a really weird and not weird but definitely a different experience from finding out i was pregnant the first time finding out i was pregnant the first time i had been testing but i had skipped a day of testing so i feel like maybe this is that day like i never saw tests as faint as i did yesterday looking at them now they're like so 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 faint but i just was like looking for anything and then i took them today and you can finally see it on the first response and the wanfo this feels like a science experiment at this point it's it's so crazy but i'm really just nervous and kind of afraid to let myself feel pregnant and like accept it only because of what happened a couple months back but I, I feel like I am. Like I, I just have this inherent feeling and in, inside, deep inside, that I am. And the lines keep getting darker. I'm just impatient and I want that answer and I hate that like feeling. I keep telling myself that this is a great practice in patience and perseverance and just waiting it out and letting things happen in their own time, which I'm really not letting things happen. I think I've spent close to $80 on pregnancy tests in the last two days. Oh, God. I guess I'm just happy to have you guys to kind of vent to in this situation. I really, it sucks because I don't keep things from Amy. Like we communicate about everything and it's so hard to just kind of act like nothing's happening, everything's fine. But I really want to make this a big deal for her because this might be the last time that I get to, you know? So... I'm just waiting for that perfect test and that perfect timing. I'm trying not to think about it too much. So I'm rambling now and um, we'll see how this goes. Thanks for sticking along for the ride. See you soon.